it's done. This origami puppet is going to be the face of my new YouTube channel. Ugh, paper cut. Huh, I need to wash this finger off in the bathroom. Ah, this is a life. Wait, did you hear that? Uh oh, they're back. Moments later. Wow, 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 wow. I can't believe both of us and many gaming characters defeated a super powerful robot. But did we, though? All I saw was a SpongeBob time card. Shh, I'm not made of special effects money. I couldn't have a big action scene. Fair enough. But earlier, what did you mean by their back? Well, ever since the video game characters came here, there have been people that hated them. And now that the game characters are a permanent part of society, a new league has been started called LAGC. Standing for League Against Game Characters. They won't stop until society is back to the way it was before the gaming rise. And the best way to do that is by defeating the people who put them in society. Us. Sorry, what did you say? Oh, come on! A few moments later. I'm gonna go film a video. But what should I do? Why don't you, Pac-Man Jr., and Toadsworth go visit Tapu Bota and do it work? Okay. Hey everybody, it's me, Calvin Minson, and in this video, I'll try to play Mario with a finger puppet. This video is totally not fake and staged. A few moments later. Now to edit the video.
a few moments later. Good, he's asleep. So you would believe that super mushrooms should be considered contraband? What was that? I'll go get the door. Hello? Anyone here? Down here. What the heck? How are you alive? It's impossible! This is a world where a sentient T-Rex robot brought every video game character to life. This isn't that weird. That's fair. But still, how do you exist? How are you alive? Sit down. This'll take a while. Centuries ago, a man thought of something. If you burn down a house, the house turns into smoke and he wondered if you could turn smoke into a house. He made it his life's work to try to do that. For decades, he tried and failed, but then he found out it was impossible to transform pre-existing matter, but it was possible to transform matter purely created to transform. And one thing that can do that is origami. He made a piece of origami be able to transform into a perfect replica of something, and then all he had to do was duplicate that piece of transforming origami, he managed to do that, but one side effect was that all duplicates would become sentient. After years of perfecting and duplicating the sentient transforming origami, he died, and when workers came to tear down his house, they recycled all the origami, and the origami ended up getting mixed up with normal paper all around the world. And our origami species has been in hiding ever since. Oh, sorry, what did you say? I wasn't listening. <sighs> Look, I came here because I want my species to come out of hiding, and the best way to show humans we mean business is by defeating Calvin Vincent. You want him killed? I want him killed? Interested? I'm in. Good morning. Myself. I'm just going to relax the rest of the day. Oh, dang it, he didn't step on those. Well, at least it's not the only trap. Oh, that must be another bomb. -om. I'll just put it in my memorabilia closet. Oh, crap. Assignment kill Calvin Manson. Good morning, baby otter. Destroy, destroy. Nice to see you, too. Well, that's one way to stop intruders. How is he not getting hurt? Huh, guess I'll have to follow him around and plant more traps. He won't get lucky next time. Four to six more days later. Ugh, how is Calvin getting so lucky? Well, get him next time. I'm going home for the day. Calvin just keeps avoiding our traps, but that's of no concern to me. What do you want, Calvin? I have a favor to ask of you. What is it? I want you to steal all the paper in the city. Why? You'll see. Ah ha 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 news! Every piece of paper in the city has mysteriously gone missing. Someone or something has broken into every place with paper and stolen it all. If you have any information on who did this, scream it from the rooftops. Uh-oh, that's not good. Carver, this seems like the kind of thing you would go on an adventure to stop. I guess. So why don't you go on another adventure? No, I'm not going to. I've already saved the internet. But 
that why? I'm done saving the world. I'm not a superhero. I'm a YouTuber. I'm a kid. I'm done. Huh. <sighs> okay. Later that night. Ah, you must be the Tapu Boy Tendu that Calvin adopted. We're gonna go on a little trip. The next morning. LADC member. What is it? Isn't that a tapper bartender that Calvin adopted? Yes. Perfect. This'll show, Calvin. Oi, what are you doing? No, no, no! Meanwhile... Good morning, obscure game characters. Pac-Man Jr., Toadsworth, Dragon Slayer Knight... Wait, where's the bartender? Calvin? Yes? The tapper bartender is missing. Oh no. What happened to him? He was kidnapped. This is the last straw. Folks, they tried to kill me many times, then all the paper in the city is stolen, and now they kidnapped tapper bartender? This is the work of LAGC. Let's go to their headquarters. Later. We're here. Her, do you think we were too harsh on him? No, he was a friend of Calvin's. The type of bartender deserved to die. Wait, did you hear that? Quick, hide in that other room. Phew, that was close. Calvin, what's that? I think that's the computer that has all the surveillance footage on it. Maybe there's footage of them stealing the paper. <gasps> I found a video. Hello? Anyone here? Down here. <gasps> the Calvin puppet is alive? How is that even possible? Centuries ago, a man thought of something. If you burn down a house, the house turns into smoke, and he wondered if you could turn smoke into a house. He made it his life's work to try to do that. For decades, he- A few moments later. That explains everything. First a T-Rex robot AI, then every video game character coming to life, and now sentient shape-shifting origami. Wait, do you hear that? I think the coffin puppet is in the other room. You wanted to see me? Yes. Ever since you joined our organization, we've succeeded. And after you've successfully captured Tapu Bartender, you have earned my entire trust. So I now give you our most powerful item, the Galactic Orb. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You see, I never wanted to defeat Calvin. My species is the greatest there is, and I wanted to get revenge on the planet for how they treated us. And I'll do that by transforming everyone and everything on Earth into origami! Ha 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 ha! I was the one who stole all the paper, and it will be used to build an origami spaceship, and the ship will shoot a laser at Earth, transforming everyone and everything on the planet into origami! And it will be powered by this orb! <laughs> I won't let you get away with this. Yeah, you can't do that. <laughs> I already have. Uh, uh, no. Run. Okay, we're out of the building. Now I'll teleport onto the paper ship. Oh crap! Look, the paper ship is heading it is headed into space. <sighs> we finally caught up to you guys. What the heck is that? It's a magic spaceship made of paper, piloted by my Calvin origami puppet that's somehow alive. 
I choose not to question this. Well, you have to tell NASA. No, they won't believe us. We're the only people that know about this. So what should we do? There's only one thing we can do. We're going to space. But how? We don't have a spaceship. All we have is our house. Exactly. You're not thinking what I think you're thinking. We're turning our house into a spaceship. Are you serious? Come on, guys. We've saved the world before. We can do it again. Okay. I'm in. Me too. Okay. Let's do this. We did it. Get ready to blast off. Chicken, hit the blast off button. Ooh, we made it! Look, there's the paper ship! Wait, they're sending out origami clones to kill us. It shows on my totally real radar that they're right outside the door! We can't. We need to fight them. We need to be the best versions of ourselves. Get ready. Oh. 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 No. We're ready. We did it. Let's go on the paper ship. A few moments later. <laughs> there you are. You're too late. The laser is ready to shoot. Why are you doing this? If shape-shifting origami are the only living things on Earth, the planet will be a utopia. But that's not true. The world will never entirely be a utopia. You must have the good with the bad. And if the only thing on Earth is origami, what will the origami even shapeshift into? If you shoot that laser, th your species will be cursed to being paper forever. <sighs> You're right. But the laser is already about to shoot. It can't be stopped. Wait. I have an idea. I know what I must do. I'm teleporting you guys back to your house ship. That star is the only thing that won't be affected by the laser. If I drive this ship into that star as it's shooting the laser, the ship will implode. But I have to pilot it. Goodbye. He saved us. We only have enough gas to get back to Earth. We need to go now. Fine. Hey everybody, it's me, Calvin Minson. Hey Calvin, what happened to the Calvin puppet? His name is Cal, and I don't want to talk about it. <sighs> I miss Cal. <laughs> What the heck? I finally made it back. How are you alive? You see, the paper ship had an escape pod that looked just like the DeLorean. And since I accidentally left the magic orb in the escape pod, it gave the escape pod the power to travel through time. 
So the escape pod basically became the actual DeLorean. So right before the ship crashed, I got in the escape pod and accidentally sent myself 500 years ago. And it took me five months to get back here. Wow. Well, there's something I think you should see. Go outside. He did it. I saved the galaxy from battle around me. The entire world did change for the whole rest of my days. It's a lot, but you can talk. This thing is worse than you thought. But there is more thing that's worth saving the world. Being a YouTuber.